what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so we're just gonna hop right on into it we have an update regarding halloween kills and the trailer and a new image that just came out today courtesy of empire so jumping on into where this trailer information or this trailer update on when we can expect the trailers coming from is coming to us from dave mccray those of you who follow dave mccray i know i am one of his followers i love his content love his halloween updates love his thoughts and opinions on all things michael myers uh he shared this regarding a trailer and he stated I have it on good authority from a trusted source that there will be no Halloween Kills trailer in May or June. You're looking at July. He has also done an updated video throughout this topic where he has made it clear that it's sounding like what this trusted source of his is saying is that the trailer will be released in July. Now, of course, that can always change just as he has mentioned in his video anything that comes out from him usually when it's involving a trusted source as i've seen many times before with his patterns it's because he has it on 100 percent uh authority or 100 percent reliability in what they're saying is now actually correct versus if they're not 100 percent positive he won't put out something like this and on the occasions where he's done this in the past it's ended up being correct and it's ended up happening or it's ended up being something that was right on the spot so he also touched on what day it could possibly release the day that it could be released according to what he was speculating could be july 8th because july 8th last year i think he's correct i was trying to find it i couldn't really fact check it so if one of you guys could that'd be great if you were able to find something uh i couldn't find it for the amount of time i was trying to find it but on july 8th apparently that's when we got the announcement that the film would get delayed so maybe they want to do a special little nod to that and honor that by releasing the new first trailer on that same date they could also release this with the purge the forever purge which is supposed to come out in july on the fourth of july weekend that's the most likely time frame we should expect to see the halloween kills trailer if its plan is to come out in july that's also not a far-fetched uh thing to be hearing about coming from this person dave mccray saying it's coming from that's not a far-fetched idea given that the forever purge will probably be the most uh sought after horror film for people that are wanting to go back to the theaters in july since the purge is a very well-known franchise it has blumhouse attached to it as well as universal pictures so i would expect the first trailer for halloween kills to be attached to the forever purge when it releases during the fourth of july weekend later this year that is when we'll have our first look at michael myers at these new at not the new but the new characters involved and the returning characters that we haven't seen since halloween 1978 per this new timeline that they've set up of course we know that we've seen tommy doyle if you want to look at other timelines like the thorn timeline so it's all uh just based off of this timeline this will be the first time we'll see these characters since that timeline and the trailer itself honestly i don't know what more else they could show us just other than some more gore that we haven't seen in the other teasers and show us some other things that we can some other sequences to get us excited maybe something involving allison and the shape maybe karen and her interaction with the shape because again i think karen will personally not make it out of halloween kills i think that'll be the last thing that we see this character unfortunately falling victim to michael myers to now let the playing field be even for what comes in halloween ends and then we also got our first look at michael myers in the film today from empire another newly released image not necessarily our first look but i guess our first nice look at him and this bloody knife that he has in his hand his very much now part of his dna knife uh awesome shot here of the shape he looks amazing the mask is very on point in terms of what i would expect given what happened at the end of the 2018 film he looks amazing this mask honestly rivals what they gave us in the 2018 film in my opinion depending on how this looks on screen in the final product once i see this i would say that this mask is going to be better than what we got in the 2018 film now of course if everyone's probably thinking about what buster rhymes would think about this <laughs> this definitely goes in line with his comments towards michael at the end of halloween resurrection he looks definitely a little crispy here so nice little image of michael myers there so that's really all i have to say about halloween kills there's been not much that's come out other than this new image and then dave mccray giving us this update about when we can expect the trailer i know it's been a while since i had done a video on the channel about this film i cannot wait for it to come out i am expecting to see the movie before it's released as i do plan to see with all the major 
horror movies that come out this year and then what i'll do is this would be one of the other mini films that i plan to do a review for later this year on the channel since i did a review for the first time in who knows how long on this channel for spiral i'll be doing reviews for, for just like i did for spiral halloween kills a quiet place to the conjuring three definitely scream five um so i can't wait to see this film can't wait to put a review out on the channel regarding it definitely excited to see how this bridges into halloween ends because i know that whatever happens in halloween kills it's gonna be something brutal i expect this movie to end on an emotional level i don't expect it to be something happy nothing as kind of up in the air as with halloween 2018 not to say that halloween 2018 wasn't in it of itself kind of like an open in the up in the air ending since we don't really know for certain if michael myers is dead or not but it's also just like with halloween kills what i expect is for the movie to end on an emotional level that has to do with someone suffering some sort of heartbreak because of what the shape has done michael myers has done to a character that we have been with or been following since either the last movie or maybe even someone from the 78 film that's returning in this movie as well and again my thoughts on that is that it will be karen strode falling victim at the very end to bridges in the halloween ends where we will see allison strode carry on the legacy of the strode women and she will be the one to take out the shape at the very end kind of like just saying this is her way of taking back not only the the lives that were destroyed from her grandmother who suffered from it who suffered from the events of the 78 film but she's kind of going to be taking back her narrative this goes back to what kind of how jamie lee curtis promoted the 2018 film allison will be the one to end all of this for the stroll women she will be the state she will be the angel for their for their legacy she will not remain tortured by these knights she will come out a hero she will end the shape she will get justice for not only herself but her mother and her grandmother alike jamie lee curtis's character of lois Stroh will most likely bite the dust in halloween ends honestly if if someone's gonna bite the dust it's gonna be her it's not gonna be allison but, but let me know what you guys think about this about the trailer update and what it might come out in july if you haven't already make sure you subscribe turn on post notification in this video in the description i have links on my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know any movies news or reviews you like me to cover in the future all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video